This video is going to show how to create a clocked D flip-flop spice model in ORCAD pSpice. Open the provided design in ORCAD pSpice 23.1. Select Place, pSpice Part, Modeling Application from the menu. In the Modeling Application, expand Digital, Flip-Flops. Select Clocked D, Set Reset. This model contains preset and clear pins which can be used to set the output of the flip-flop without the clock. In the Options window, set the clock to output delay to 150 nanoseconds, the set reset delay to 175 nanoseconds, the setup time to 20 nanoseconds, and the hold time to 2 nanoseconds. Set the threshold to 2.5 volts, the history sys width to 2, the output resistance to 1 milliohm, and the input resistance to 10 gigaohms. Click Place. Click to place the flip-flop in the schematic. Select the Voltage Level Marker button from the toolbar. Click to place probes on the clock, data, and data out nets. Right-click and select End Mode when finished. Select PSPICE Run from the menu. View the simulation results. The output follows the data input. A D flip-flop can also be used as a push-on, push-off circuit. Back in the schematic, select Stimulus D Stim 1 and press Delete on the keyboard. Select Place wire from the menu, the wire button from the toolbar, or press W on the keyboard. Click to connect the data net to the Q-bar output. Press Escape on the keyboard. Select P-Spice, Run from the menu. The output now oscillates at half the clock frequency and is inverted at the data input. Quickly create the required D flip-flop spice models and simulate accurate digital circuit behavior with the P-Spice modeling application in ORCAD P-Spice. For more tutorials, visit us at resources.ema-eda.com, and don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.